Hi everybody. In today's video, we're going to explore the BlazerNet Launchpad. You can access BlazerNet by going to jwcc.edu and selecting BlazerNet, or you can access it directly by typing in blazernet.jwcc.edu. Supported browsers are Google Chrome, Firefox, and Safari. Now on campus, we have what's called single sign-on. What that means is if you're here on campus and you log in with Google Chrome and access BlazerNet, you will not be prompted or asked for your username and password because you've already signed into the computer. This is not going to be the way it works at home because you don't have single sign-on at home. So if you're at home and you're using Google Chrome, you will be prompted for that username and password. Now as you can see, this page is full of goodies. But for the purpose of this video, we're just going to specifically walk through the Launchpad items. The first item here is Canvas. Canvas is our learning management system, and it's used for all classes. Both students and faculty utilize Canvas to access classroom information such as grades, assignments, and due dates. We'll look at Canvas in detail in its own video. Now the next item is email. This is your John Wood email. It will contain important information from the school information about financial aid, information about upcoming dates and deadlines, and information about social activities, clubs, and organization. It's not to be confused with the Canvas inbox. They are not one and the same, and you should check both daily. The next item on the launch pad is Solar. Solar stands for Student Online Access to Records. This is where you're going to go to view your personal information, your schedule, your midterm and final grades, your access to transcripts and financial aid information. And then we have the library. I encourage you to go out and explore the library link. There's tons of information in there and you will find stacks of resources. And then we have your OneDrive. Your OneDrive is your cloud-based storage. This means that you will be able to get to your files anywhere that you have an internet connection. Whether it be home, work, school, McDonald's, or maybe a coffee shop, you'll be able to get to those files. Matter of fact, if you're here at school and you save your file to the computer and the computer gets rebooted, um, chances are you're going to lose that information. So you want to make sure that you save your files to that OneDrive. The next item on the launch pad is Office 365. If we open Office 365, you're going to notice a bunch of apps. Like the OneDrive, these apps are cloud-based, so you'll be able to access them any place that you have that internet connection as well. There's um, Word, Excel, PowerPoint, those are some of the common ones. And then, and then if you click on all apps, you'll see that there's more that you can use. I also wanted to point out that if we click on Office 365, as a student of John Wood Community College, you are entitled to install the full-blown Microsoft Office product on up to five devices. And the way you would do that is you would just go here to Install Office and click on either Office 365 apps or other install options. And then once you do that, you just follow the directions. This intranet, it has a little bit of information, so you might want to check on that. Regroup is the tool that we use for group communications. One of the things that we would use it for would be weather-related school closings. So this would be where you would go to alter that information. Starfish is our retention software. We use this to monitor student success. Our students are very important to us. They're our number one priority, so Starfish also provides early alerts for any issues so that our students get the needed help before it's too late. And lastly is tutoring. Um, this link will take you to our tutoring webpage where you will find information about walk-in tutoring, the writing center, um, and even online tutoring. So that covers our BlazerNet Launchpad. Thanks for watching, and please stop by our call if you have any questions.